He would know something about this. All right. So yeah, um, interesting little fact for people who've played the Dot Hag games previously and recognize Data Drain, which happened to say at the start. When you data drained a mob in the original Dot Hat games, it would reset them back to level one. And Saseo got data drained. Now level one as well. We're looking for Ovon. You can actually trade with players, which is kind of cool. A lot of times they have equipment that you want, things like that. But I remember running around trading with players for hours. Hey, do you know what that guy's job was? I don't think I've seen a design like that. I didn't look that closely. I saw him head towards the harbor. Maybe I'll go get a closer look. The talking's supposed to simulate Haseo seeing things like in game chat and stuff like that. Um, yeah, Lee, but I'm playing from the very start. I haven't played this game in like 10 years, dude. We are definitely playing from the start. Absolutely. Some people might be starting up from like the new episode, but no, we're starting from the very beginning. I'm gonna get the full nostalgia trip. And see where we have to go on the map. Oh my god, that player looks really hot! Really? I thought he looked kind of creepy. So, you like guys that look like that? Uh, I think you went down that alley. Oh, and to be fair, uh, Ovan's a steam gunner, so. Dude, talk about play from the very beginning, you mean infection. Infection was the first one. Infection, mutation, quarantine, then outbreak. Since technically the, event, the events of original Hot Hat games did also affect this game as well. Damn. Oh shit! It's those player killers. Huh? It's not much of a challenge when they're so pathetically weak. <laughs> yeah, I know what you mean. Fighting those noobs is making us all rusty. That rogue that we fought the last time. He really wasn't that bad. Um, you mean we're going after him next? Hell yeah. There is no way in hell. I can back down after what happened last time. E yes, ma'am. Wait, what the hell am I hiding for? Why do I have to hide from bastards like them? It's pathetic. What the hell's going on? Ah! Gaspard, are you okay? <gasps> Gaspard! Um, huh? What happened? Are you okay? Uh, yeah. Hey, are you a new player? You're a noob? Oh, <laughs> hey, I'm sorry. I guess I must have scared you, huh? Hell no, I'm not a noob. I'm the terror of death. Terror of what? What? Wait, are, are you talking about the famous PKK, Haseo? Oh, you're a player killer killer. I knew I'd heard about him somewhere before, but... I'm pretty sure the player's name was Haseyo. Are you sure? Definitely. Yep. Hey, look. It's me. I'm the real PKK Haseyo. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, but you'll have to gain more levels before you can say anything like that. What? Hey. 
If you're a noob, we'll be happy to teach you the basics of this game. Actually, <laughs> Syllabus and I are part of the Noob Support Guild called Canard. Noob Support Guild? It's a guild that teaches noobs all they need to know to become top players. We're actually pretty famous, you know. Oh yeah, I need to give you our member addresses first. Here. Member addresses are an address system. Oh, man. Just for communicating it's just with your my luck to get world. mixed up with when a bunch of weirdos. Party, I even lost sight of Ovon. Anyway, right now, I've got to level back up to become the Terror of Death. Well, I guess I'll just hang out with them for a little while longer. Look, it doesn't mean that they'll join just because you invite them to. Um, were you listening to me? Yeah, I was listening. You were? Really? Yes, really. Anyway, come on. You're gonna teach me the basics, right? So hurry up and let's move on to the next lesson. Okay, then let's go to an area. Now, invite us into your party and we'll go find the Chaos Gate. Invite us to your party, but we've already joined. There are warp points all over the city that we can use. Just solid system. Under the dome. But it also simulates them also taking the same warp points. This is the Chaos Gate. If you input three different types of words into... I know that. Okay, well then, a good area for a noob is... Delta Peaceful Leading Freedom. That should be a good place to start. Save real quick. I've been playing for 45 minutes. Party feels violated. Why is that, Arma? So we have a bunch of different keywords. The cool thing is, so when we do collect keywords from the uh, the forums, it tells us what the keywords are for. So, area word posted on the forum by Renji. Maybe challenging for my level, or for level 10 players. Challenging for level 10 players. Area posted on the forums by Applestar. Acquire Ohm shells by breaking the barrels in this area. So this is a place to get Ohm shells and then challenging for level 10 players. We're level 1, so we're probably not going to go to a level 10 area. We're headed to Delta Peaceful Leading Freedom. Attention! Bringing one noob to the dungeon! Repeat! Bringing one noob to the dungeon! I told you that I'm not a noob! I know, I know. You're really the terror of death, right? I can understand you wanting to roleplay something like that, but I'm not really sure if you should do terror of death, you know? Player killers are going to come after you, and it'll definitely be rough for you. Hey, just shut up and listen! So you're saying you're really the PKK Haseo, the terror of death? And when you logged in, your level went down from 133 to 1? No way! I've never heard of a bug quite like that! Wow! I'm not lying! Okay, but still... Gaspard, that's what he's role-playing. Oh, now I get it. <laughs> that's some really complicated character background. It's not role-playing! Don't be embarrassed. We'll accept your character concept. Just relax and come with us. Will you please listen to me already? <laughs> Yo, they're into the RP. The enemy has been spotted. Okay, maybe we should start by telling you about the skill trigger. 
I already know about that. But how could you know? You're just a noob. No, I'm not. Uh, why don't we give it a shot? Just don't listen. Okay, come on, Haseo. Let's go fight the monsters. Asparger, so the skill trigger, freaking nice. Okay? Not good. Yeah, looks like you can use the skill trigger just fine. I just can't believe that you're a noob. I told you, I'm not a... Okay, okay. Let's move on. Will you two just listen to me? <laughs> Alright, so the maps have to be figured out and stuff still. So. Yeah, level 133 to 1, CC has really awful, awful tech support. Well, now that you know how to use the skill trigger, let's learn about Rengeki. I already know about... Uh, okay, then let's go and fight them! I'll tell you the timing to execute it, so make sure you use it. Ah, listen to me, damn it! Don't worry, we're listening, all right. Yeah, right. Look. Damn, this is bad. To be fair, on their point, like... Sayo is just really, really angry and mean all the time, and they're totally like listening to him. They're not listening to him, but they're at least they're uh, still helping him, you know, after he's been so mean and shit. Can't sleep till you hit 61. Good luck, Arma. Hey, your Rengeki was pretty good. Duh. Wow! Way to go, Haseo! Nice! I was so bad when I was a noob. Good job! I told you, I'm not a... Yeah, no one would think you're a noob with your skills. Hey, come on! Let's keep going! 4% away, dude. Keep going, you're at it. You're almost there. Hearing anything I'm saying to you? Poor guy. Oh, that's the way down. Hang on, there should be... There was more to this map, wasn't there? Yeah, there was. Totally was. Go check out this other side here. Oh. Jim Jim's. Let some chimps. Yo, Gaspar, I don't want to talk to you. Grab some chimps. Let's start with six. That's you knew six in the morning, dude. That's super early. It's only 1.40 a.m. here, so not too bad. <laughs> I'm getting oh, nervous. I didn't... Okay, I messed that up for the sneak attack. Hundred percent run. That's the idea. I think even I can win. So I'll be fighting the doppelganger. I've got to remember how to like actually summon him and everything. Get his weapon. All that good stuff. It's 1:43 p.m. for you. <laughs> nice. 
But yeah, Lebo, that's the idea. That's what I'll be going for. I think I might end up putting chat on stream in a decent spot. I just haven't decided where yet. But that's right. When I alt tab, I'm gonna bring up stuff. Can I alt tab out? Okay, yeah, I did. Oh, okay. Actually, let me alt tab. So I think I will pull chat in. I think I'll put chat in like a very small spot. Okay. Okay, there we go. We have Twitch chat now. Okay, there we go. The chat will be very small and off to the side, but it'll be there. Nothing in this room. I don't know why I went this way. It's also not going to stay on screen. It's going to pop up for a little bit whenever you guys say something, and then it'll go away. So, who wants to test that? Feel free to say something, and it'll pop up for me. Oh. Okay, I'm apparently really, really bad at starting fights. Yeah, it's super tiny. There we go. I remember the first time I fought the do the doppelganger in this game. I remember him having like. First off, he was a pain in the ass to spawn, and then he has basically your stats bud buffed, and it's only one of him. It's it's a three v one, so there's one of him and three of you, but it's still a really difficult fight. I think at half HP he runs and you have to find him again. It was something crazy like that. But it was definitely cool. I should be able to get to the lower floor from here. Do you know about awakening? No, I don't. See? <laughs> I knew that you were a noob. Uh, hey! Now, now, Haseo. We'll tell you all about them, so don't scowl, okay? Yeah. So, what is this awakening thing you were talking about? Well... It's a special attack that you can do together with your party members. Do you want to give it a shot? It's a lot easier to understand it if you're in battle. Yeah, that sounds good. Let's do it. I'm going to do my best. Hey, I haven't agreed. All right, then. Let's go encounter some enemies. So Haseo always played solo. He never played in a party. So it makes sense why he wouldn't know about awakening. Awakening is a state when a special kind of power has been activated. You can use it when the morale gauge on the top right of the screen is full. Let's see, okay, our morale gauge is already full, so let's go ahead and press X. Attack way faster, looks like we crit too. Oh, all of our damage doesn't go until the end. I 
love using this technique. I think they actually just couldn't kill them with it. You just got one step closer to becoming the terror of death. The enemies get stronger as we go deeper. So let's kick some butt and get you leveled up. Let's keep it up. And for being a part of a noob support guild, they weren't very high level themselves. They were kind of two levels ahead of me, and that's about it. Door. This is one of the traps that can be found in a dungeon. These doors can be opened by inserting energy known as Chim Spheres. Chim Spheres can be obtained from mysterious creatures known as Chim Chims, which are found inside the dungeons and root towns. Six of these, which is why we, we needed five, which is why I grabbed six earlier. Oh, I forgot there'd be a second door. I still need more Chims. Rip. Grab more Chims. There was a freaking prince back there that I missed. Yeah, I forgot. You can just do that and let your teammates kick them. Kick them. I guess they're being really bad at it. Oh, 1 through 60 got made faster? Nice, nice. Alright, I think we're good on Chim Spheres for a little while. We got 24 of them. We're gonna drop 5 of them right now. I think I used to do that until I get like a whole stack of 100, like 99 of them, and then I would just. They actually interrupt my combo. Died right when you went into the Ringeki state. My controller ate one of my inputs. I definitely hit the button for it earlier and it just didn't go off. That's cool. No worries. This game isn't that difficult. I have no idea why they went with a cheat mode. Not so hard that you have to cheat. Then again, we are at the beginning of the game where all the fights are super easy. There's no like different resistances or anything like that. Fire a second weapon yet or anything like that. Hey, what's up, Coco? Where the SAO at? We played dot hack tonight. SAO gonna be on another night. Hmm, maybe tonight tomorrow night? I'm not sure yet. We'll see, but it's definitely downloaded. But I've been wanting to play this for a long time. Okay, yeah, item boxes. There are various items hidden within or hidden in the item box. There are three types of item boxes. Objects, treasures, and traps. Objects, treasures, and trap boxes. Target the item box and press A to search the item box. I convince Phil to get it. I mean, I might just buy it for him if he wants to play it, honestly. I really don't give a shit. <laughs> He's a student, so... I doubt he has 50 bucks to just toss away on a game that he might or might not like, you know? Treasure chests primarily contain accessories. Trap boxes look very similar to treasure chests that rattle. Disabling the trap within time will allow you to acquire the weapon, armor, or item within it. You know what I realized? 
at the first, um, the very first, uh, thing that we did, first dungeon, they gave us an item, but we never got to use it. Our logout item. Did we ever get to keep that equipment? No, we never, we never kept the equipment, so why did they even give it to us? I have to press the buttons. Oh god, I forgot what buttons were which. I was so slow. Oh, he can download us, yeah. Okay, Let me, there you go. Victory is ours. I mean, if it's like reviews that people are looking at, SAO like on Steam. And mind you, Steam is usually pretty brutally honest. SA has actually gotten good reviews on Steam, which is surprising. But I definitely will be playing SA. Yeah. Battle cries are pretty bad. Hey, um, do you guys know anything about Tri Edge? Tri Edge? No, what's that? Some kind of event monster or something? Yes, please. It's the screen name of a PK. Never heard of him. Me neither. This is a statue of Fulset, the god of law in the world's backstory, but we just call it the Beast Statue. And there is the treasure offering. See? Go on and open it, Haseo. It's shut out of that chest. Oh, hey, crap. Haseo. It's been a while, huh? It's Bordeaux. From Kestrel. Huh? What? Hey, who are these guys? Famous player killers. What the? Not now. Well, well. Looks like you haven't been keeping up since the last time we met. It took me a little while to recognize that you were really the terror of death. What? He's real? You're really, really the terror of death? How amazing! I mean, what a coincidence running into you here. I tell you, it has to be destiny. What the hell are you talking about? Yeah, right, moron. Give me a break. Someone sent me an anonymous email. So I decided to come and have some fun. Now, what should we play? Well, for starters, how about I love you? To death! really know what's going on. But, but, but please, no violence. Body. He got in my way. You know what I mean? God, there is nothing like PK. Wait a minute. What the? Something is... Something is starting to... 
It's growing. Hold it. Oh man. <laughs> Very first waifu of video games. At least my very first waifu. You guys look 